Hallo, dit is een update van de Tesla Mechanical Oscillator in de Cryophorus System. I had attached everything. This propane tank is fitting over the machine, attaching to those holes. Buy some glue, pressure it out, make sure there's no leakages in. And then try to pump out the uncondensable gas from the water in the boiler. The boiler is filled now with 40 liters. That's halfway now. Underneath it, I can make fire to warm it up. But I want to do first things first. Try to run it when I was sucking out the gases. And it did. But after a few seconds, it stopped because it twisted itself somehow a little bit and then it gets stuck. And I cannot get it to turn back because of this propane tank is around it and it's all vacuumed out. And that is a little bit frustrating. So I had to do something with these bearings and of course attach a generator to it because the wires here are for that. The wires are going through the plate, isolated by plastic bolts. Goes down to the bridge rectifier here and the capacitor. There's also a heat exchanger for the condensing water, heating it up a little bit from the exhaust fumes, which are attached in the middle of the plate here. Goes to the heat exchanger, goes down. To the pressure gauge and then the condensing tank. I'm not sure how to cool this one yet, but I thought first things first make sure that there's no leaking and that it runs on the pressure differential. And it did for a little bit, but then it twisted itself and then. Uh, one, uh, one other problem is that the foundation of this oscillator now is not uh, <laughs> stiff enough. Look at this little table. I make a big mistake doing this because it, the whole stuff is vibrating on the table and in time it will crack all these pipes. Anyway, still working on this project happily. Thank you for watching.